So, what we have here is a 1984 Kramer Striker. And boy, <clears throat> this thing sounds like a million dollars. I think I paid maybe 200 bucks for this thing a very long time ago. And I cut the pick guard, get that shark fin look. Uh, I had to put some spray cleaner in the knobs and switch. So they were crackling a little bit. Don't you love the electrical tape? I love electrical tape. So we're just putting some strings on this thing. Going to be doing some uh, slide bar work on a video. Um, so right here we have an original Gibson PAF, probably, mm, I want to say mid-70s, early 1970. I bought it from a store out in California a uh, long, long time ago. I can't remember the name of the store. So I'm putting some Diodero Gauge 8 strings on it. And um, you, know, you feed them in through the back. And it's going to hook them up. Nothing fancy. I don't really use the tremolo on this. It's not that great of a tremolo. It's their standard issue thing is kind of crap, actually. But then I got a little 59er in the center position. And a hot rail Seymour Duncan in the uh, neck position. And other than that, I stripped this down years ago and spray painted it with model paint, this greenish gold. It's probably a 25 year old paint job. It's pretty worn. But that's what's great about it. You can, you know, play in the clubs and you can spill uh, drinks on it or cigarette ashes if somebody's smoking when they're playing it. And it doesn't really matter. It still works great. And that's all I need. 84 Kramer Striker. We'll get these strings hooked up here pretty quick. Be right back. So, got the strings on there. It's always nice to have new strings on there. Um, as far as winding them on the pegs, some people have their certain ways of doing it. I like to try to get as much uh, string wind on the peg as possible. Stretch them out really good after I tune. I tuned to 440A. I used to tune a half step down, but I got bored with that, so I brought it back up to A, 440. So you got to really stretch them out for, shoot, a half hour or so. Um, keep tuning it up. You'll probably have to retune it four or five times at least till they stretch out pretty good. Once they stretch out, though, this, this thing holds tune perfectly. 84 Kramer. It's a pretty good sounding guitar, too, with these Duncans and that PAF in there. And my favorite part of this guitar is... The electrical tape. Have you ever seen such beautiful, exquisite, ginormous electrical tape? I sure haven't. That's the best electrical tape I've ever seen there. I'm getting a close-up. See, see the electrical tape? Isn't that nice? Isn't that just beautiful? That's my favorite part. Alrighty, here we go. And I think the first new song I'm going to write on this, of these new strings, is... I think that would sell a million trillion copies. What do you think? <laughs> 